Hey guys, Dusty with Rocky Mountain Crane here. We're going to go over opening this panel, showing you guys how the crane starts up and looking at these variable frequency drives in case there's an air code on one of them, you know what you're looking at. First off, we open up this bottom panel. If it's locked, once again, use the key. That could be a little stiff. And you open up both of these. All right, so inside this panel, We've got our processor, it's called the CCS here. And then these three big drives are what we call the variable frequency drives. We've got the uh, swing, trolley, and hoist. So I'm gonna go ahead and connect the crane up here. While we're doing that, down here is our list of breakers. So you wanna make sure every time, if there's an issue that all these breakers are on, none of these are tripped. That's off, that's on, that's off, that's on. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and connect the crane up. Okay, the crane's connected up. As you can see up there, all of them say RDY. That's where you're going to see an air code if there is one. The swing drive does not say RDY. It tells you what the RPMs are. And then when you do a function, you're going to see something move on each one of these drives and that's the speed or RPM of the motor whatever the drive output is putting out but if we ask you to look at a drive those are the things that we're looking at for you to look at <laughs> 